Dream up new ways to play using Toy-Con Garage Mode. In part two of this video series, we'll make a Toy-Con RC tank. Toy-Con Garage is a secret area hidden deep inside the Nintendo Labo software included in each kit. Here you can invent your own Toy-Con projects. Let's take a look at how we built ours using the right Joy-Con controller's IR motion camera. Neat, huh? This little monster dude we made has target practice written all over him. On its back is the left Joy-Con controller, and his face has a marker sticker on it. The RC tank is ready and waiting. As for the quote-unquote cannon, it's a pen taped on top of the Toy-Con RC car. So that's the RC tank, but how does it move? If you press the SL button, the right Joy-Con controller vibrates. If you press the SR button, the left Joy-Con controller vibrates. Just connect these boxes and there you have it, an RC tank. Next, let's put the IR motion camera to good use. Clearly, the camera sees the world in black and white. If the monster's marker sticker gets caught in its sights, he'll shake with fear as the Joy-Con vibrates. Ooh. Here's how we set the nodes. Can you believe there's a node for having the marker sticker in view? Let the showdown begin! Steer the tank so that it's facing Mr. Monster Dude and, and, yes! Mission faceplant accomplished! How can we take our RC tank to the next level? Let's try adding another input node. Something with a button press would work. Then we'll connect that with this AND node. That way our old rival won't fall over until the camera sees the marker sticker and a button is pressed. Hmm, needs some kind of sound effect. This time we'll add an output node that makes a sound. We can set this one here and another here and that should do it. Fire at will. It's a hit! The sound effect totally sold the moment. What if we give the Joy-Con controller a falling sound effect? <laughs> yes! Oh, what if we set the screen to light up when he falls so this paper cutout will glow? <laughs> nice! You can really get carried away making your own Toy-Con creations. What kind of tank will you make? Remember the IR motion camera we showed you? You may know that the IR stands for infrared. Basically, infrared rays are a type of light that are invisible to the human eye. Spooky, I know. But the IR motion camera can see these rays and use them to make out shapes and movements. And because they're infrared rays, the camera can even see them in the dark. The marker sticker we showed you earlier is made of a material that can reflect light at the IR motion camera. Marker stickers can be used in all kinds of ways in the included Toy-Con projects. So you could say these marker stickers are very important when making Toy-Con creations. Master using the IR motion camera and marker stickers to make your Toy-Con creations really stand out. You may be able to find similar items like reflective tape or reflective sheets at certain stores. Next time, we'll bust out our sweet rubber band guitar. Look forward to our jam session, okay?